Ladies and gentlemen, um, real quick, before we get to the review, it's worth noting that I am doing a brand new review style. Basically, for the review videos, we'll do a quick little review in the review box, and then we'll bring the car out and do some track testing. Basically, we're going to race it down this two-lane track against another car, and whoever wins two races first will get to go on the King of the Hill pedestal today. Then, in the future, we'll, every time we do a review, which will be on a weekly basis, the car we will review will take on the King of the Hill, which will be right here. Um, they'll do a best two out of three, um, and the winner gets to go on the King of the Hill pedestal. So basically, there's going to be a weekly King of the Hill tournament going on. Videos for the reviews will be posted every Tuesday. All the cars that try over the course of the year will go on this stand. All right, that's all. Let's get to the review. What's up, ladies and gentlemen? Thank you for watching that introduction if you did. If not, you're now at the review section of the video. That was just a little information on what reviews are going to look like in the future. Anyways, today we are taking a look at the Corvette C7 Z06, part of Factory Fresh Series, new for 2017 model. Looks very, very nice. I'm going to be a bit briefer with these reviews now in the future since we are doing races in the latter portion. It was born in 2016. Birthplace, Detroit, Michigan, and the designer, of course, is Chevrolet. Specialty with 650 horsepower and a supercharged V8, the 2016 Corvette C7 Z06 is brutally fast. Blasting from 0 to 60 in 3.3 seconds. No wonder Corvette has been an Indy 500 pace car more times than any other model in the race's history. This super sleek coupe is designed for the road, but even better on the track. So there it is. Looks very nice. I hope you guys like my new review studio. It looks very nice. I like that black background a lot. Anyways, I got it cracked open right now. Let's put it in there. Whew. Scoot it back a little so you can see it better on the camera. It looks very nice against that background, if I say so myself. That's why um, I got a new review space. Anyways, um, let's go ahead and take a look at it. Relatively simple tampos. Just a yellow or black stripe on the top. Um, got some nice headlights there and the Corvette logo. We do get tail lights and the Corvette logo. Very clean, very simple. I like it a lot. It looks absolutely um, amazing, if I say so myself. Um, back wheel is enlarged a little bit, um, so you just got to kind of find the right angle to display it at so it doesn't throw the proportions off that much. That's all I have to say on it, though. Um, personally, I will probably collect every version of this model. Huge Corvette fan. Um, this, of course, being one of the fastest Corvettes the world has seen. So, um... It's worth picking up if uh, you want a recommendation. Scale of 1 to 10, I'm going to give it a 8.5. Like I said, that back wheel just doesn't quite work for me, which throws it off a little. you got to find the right angle. Uh, the back angle, I think, is the best one. Anyways, um, that's all for the review. Let's get to the track test. All right, so the Corvette Z06 is ready to take on the King of the Hill. But, of course, we don't have a King of the Hill because this is the first ever review. No problem, though. We will have him take on the 2014 Ford Mustang GT convertible because this was a 2017 new model as well. So we got two 2017 new models ready to take each other on in the King of the Hill match. All right. First to two wins becomes the first ever King of the Hill on the Hot Wheels Tournament's review series. On your marks, get set, go. Mustang with the early lead. Corvette with a big comeback, though. We're in for a good couple of races, folks. All right, it looks like the Mustangs got a fairly good start and got some great acceleration. However, the Z06 is just faster in the straights. It'll be interesting to see how this second race goes. If the Z06 wins, he's king of the hill. On your marks, get set, go. Yep, it's Z06 all the way. He's your first The Z06 is the first ever king. And since we did review the Mustang earlier in the year, We'll put him on the shelf, and uh, since we did track test him, he also earns a spot. It's worth mentioning, all kings that lose will go on this top row. Every other car we, re we review will fill up these bottom levels. So that's all for now, guys. Please like, comment, subscribe, and thanks for watching. Peace.